Hello number one! How you all doing? It's your truly this small GT speaking here and welcome back to Senpai Total War Let's Play of Westphalia. In the last episode, France declared war on us and tried to take Flanders and Rhineland away from us. We repelled both of those attacks and right now we are trying to set our target and try to take over Paris itself. But I am very hesitant of actually going and trying to take Paris right now because of these freaking armies right here. But I feel like if I want to make some progress against France here, I think the best thing to do right now is to possibly maybe sacrifice Flanders. Like I don't mind if they take it away from us or not, but I really don't know what kind of option I have here. But before we end this turn, I think a good thing to do might be to actually besiege this star fort. Because this is the biggest army they have near their capital. There is no way in hell that I am assaulting this. Because we are gonna have way too many casualties. And I wanna try and stay as healthy as possible where we're gonna go and assault their capital. And actually, um... Wait, if I take you away from here, are you gonna be mad? No, you're still neutral. Okay, I can just move you guys over here. Okay, that adds another line of defense. Uh, and I think I'm actually gonna send uh, you over here so they can't recruit any fleet over there. The last thing I want is to France to blockade my port. And that is just gonna put... Uh, we are gonna get bankrupt if that, if that happens. But other than that, we can only hope that France is not going to go for my capital again, or Flanders, but eh, we'll, we'll see what happens. Ah, uh, you're attacking with that uh, army right there, that means we don't need to deal with the fort itself. But I don't mind that. Wait, just because we're besieging, doesn't that mean they're going to stay at the fort then? If I can try and eliminate as many as I can without taking too many casualties myself. This is actually not a bad idea. Uh, but hopefully I'll be right about it. Right, so if I had to take a guess, because they attacked us from the side, they're probably gonna... The reinforcement are probably gonna come from over here-ish if I had to take a wild guess. But then again, where the reinforcement come from can be a little bit of a mystery. Now let's see, uh, I think this would actually be a good place for the artillery because of the hilly terrain. Put you there. Uh, I think I'm gonna place the other artillery right there, so I'll just place you there for the meantime. Pikeman, you're gonna be the cannon father, that's what I brought you. And actually, um, I'm actually gonna put you guys right here. So if it is that they're gonna come from over here, at least I'll have them ready. And this is probably going to be a bit of a tough battle, because they mostly have infantry. But, we do have fire by rank, so at least we have an advantage when it comes to that. Put you there. Uh, I suppose... Uh, yeah, I think that... I think that's good enough. Don't know what to do about the cavalry just yet. I could maybe try and... Uh, harass the colonel a little bit. The one that's in here somewhere. And I think that's good. Now, where's the reinforcement gonna come from? I bloody well knew it. It's coming from over there. Pikeman, try to keep them occupied. You move over here. Now, where the hell is there? Okay, it's that guy right there. 22. Now, I just need to line you guys up so you can meet them over there. Uh... I don't think I only need you guys. Yeah, you guys should be enough to take care of these guys. And the rest can just turn around and try to face these guys. Like, I believe this is gonna be tough, but I might have... It might actually be working in my failure because it's winter. And I'm gonna be suffering from cold fatigue, which is good. Alright, alright, I think that's good enough. I can only hope that the pike might get there in time. And one thing then, we don't need to deal with their uh, artillery that they got in there. I think it's fine if you just run. I think that will be fine. Let's see, uh, where are you guys running? Are we gonna go meet those guys? 
Let's see, are we in position yet? Soon. Okay, good. Now, where the hell are you guys going? To oh, yeah, you're coming over here. Eh, no, ne no need to worry, though. There we go. Alright, uh, this should be fine. Let me see, artillery, are you in position? Yes, you are. I think it might be time for you guys to use canister shot. No, they just ran away. Okay, good. Let's see, is that the colonel? No, it's not. That's the 4th regiment. I'm looking for the 22nd. I feel very confident about this battle here. But I'm also a bit concerned. Because the last time when we, when I was so completely sure about this, it was when we were battling Prussia. Even though we had five rank, we still suffered a lot of freaking casualties. Even though we had uh, better military technology than they have, so it, it might actually be, we might actually be, uh, be doing bad here. But we'll see what happens. You're not close enough for cannon shots. That's no, no. Uh, missile carrier, try to go around and try to help them a little bit. Yeah, I think you guys can turn around as well. I just want you guys trying to focus on these guys. Uh, Pikeman. Oh yeah, you, oh, 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 you're gonna start firing at them. Uh, that's a no-no. Holy crap, this snow is killing my frames. <laughs> but then again, I'm forced to keep it up as a, at, a, at a lesser quality here, just because of a certain... Uh, quality drop right here. That enemy general killed is the one that I think it is. Alright, nice. Good, then we had dealt with that problem. We can actually turn back a little bit. Uh, you guys can focus on this guy here. Good, now, now that I got the general out of the way, this should be, get a bit more easier. The, are you guys doing well? You're losing slightly, that's good. You can go ahead and help them over here. I think I can use the missile cavalry here. Oh yeah, yeah, that's 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 definitely enough. You can go over here, try to harass them a little bit. Let me see, where is our general? You can go ahead and support your guys over there. And I think yeah, I think we're just gonna move up the artillery. Yeah, that's good. You guys can take care of that. Let me see, what about my other cavalry? I really don't have any plans for you guys. Let's see, let me see. Did you do well there, Pikeman? Uh, uh you could have done a little bit better, but uh, beggars can't be choosers, I guess. Then I make sure you get that guy out of the way. That guy, I thought it hot. I thought I told you to limber up. Guys, for the love of God, just limber up already. Go around there and flank them. No need to worry about them anymore. Alright, now I want everyone to go ahead and focus on these guys over here. Okay, you're just shaking those guys away. That's good. I don't think that those guys will become a problem. Oh, and I forgot about you guys. I wonder if I can use my general on this. I, I think it's fine if I use him. But then again, I really don't want to do it. It's a, it's a pretty good general because of the morale boost of it that he gives. Oh my god, shoot, shoot. For the love of god, please. Uh, no, you don't have your guns ready. Oh, balls and a half. Uh, oh, no, 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 don't fire. Come on, general. Show, him, show, him what you, show them what you're dealing with here. Okay, good. You're taking care of those guys. They're shattered. Good. Now I can move up the artillery. I think I can actually place you guys over here-ish. I think that would be a good place for you. And what the heck are you doing now, Franz? Are you doing a little bit of a rush tactic? Uh, okay. I don't like all of that. Pull back, General. So, a fight between two bayonet-equipped infantry units. That, okay, you just got caught off by your own advice there, sir. See, is everything going well over here? Yeah, by the looks of it. I can actually move you guys up like this. You can get a better shot. 
from a winning slide. God damn it, where are my gra uh, grenadiers? Uh, okay, there's one right there. You know what? Just, just throw at him. Wait, what did they just do? Wait, 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 wait. You did it, did the throwing animation. You just threw grenades. If that's the weirdest uh, uh, glitch, I don't know what is. Why did he keep engaging in melody? Those guys need help. Uh, you need to fire at these guys over here. General, are you doing well? You're winded, so that's a no no. Uh, yeah, you guys. You guys have to go over there. See, Miss Alcabri, how are you doing? You can move up a little bit, I guess. I honestly thought this was going to I thought this was going to be a little bit more exciting, but eh. God damn, we're probably not going to. We're probably going to lose a lot of men here. But at least we're in a good position here. We're dealing with the reinforcements. Oh, and you guys. Oh, no. You guys are gone. Okay, this is bad. I need to reposition you guys. Move away a little bit. Oh, yes. Yes, this is really bad. Just move back a little bit so we can regroup and think here. Are the, oh, those cam... Okay, that's my cavalry taking care of them over there. Is it, that's the general. Try to take care of him so we don't need to deal with him later. Oh, we're losing a lot of guys here, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna charge right through that, but you should be able to pull your weight. And I thought I told myself I didn't want to lose too many, too many guys here. I am basically going against that right now. But there's one thing I came to learn about myself that I am a, I'm a huge ass hypocrite when it comes to things. And I think that I don't mean it intentionally, intentionally even. It just happens. When I mean one thing, another thing happens, and oh god, you are completely wrecking my, uh, my engineers. And it's not cool, Franz. I thought you were cool. But no, no, no. It all started when you just completely uh, torn apart our trade agreement. Then you keep bitching about that you want to come back to me, but I keep denying you. But, like, come on, Franz. I gave you a chance. No, 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 wait. I didn't give you a chance at all. Like, I wanted to give you a chance, but you just, you just completely telling me to fuck off. At least that's how I felt when you did that to me. You know what? I think I'm gonna keep that cavalry right there. You guys are doing well. You need to run away a little bit. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Chase down that general. He is not leaving this battlefield alive. Okay, is that cavalry taken care of? Uh, I can't remember if they had any more uh, cavalries, uh, but I, don't, I think that might have been the last one. Uh, I think so, at least. You can't... Oh, guys, for the love of God, can you limber up already? Are you stuck or something? Oh, you're stuck, aren't you? This guy is just completely frozen. Have you have your hands frozen into the bloody wheel or something? Okay, well that's a bummer. Now, let's see, what about you? You didn't manage to get the general, but uh, uh, it, it's fine, I guess. Let's see how are you guys doing? Taking care of that guy over there. I think. Oh, okay, because you have crowded. I can move you and you up so we can help with against that. Ugh, I really hope that we win this. But it looks kind of unwinnable at the moment. Drop that. I think I can move you guys up a little bit. Maybe like so. Now you guys are coming from behind, which is good. Ugh. I think I might actually have to occupy the Star Fort before I even dare to assault the uh, Paris itself. Just out already, you bloody baguette loving piece of shit! And please, don't take any offense of what I just said. I don't hate French people, it's just that the game wants me to hate you. It's like a love-hate relationship. Good, you're broken, good. You guys 
help out over here. If we can, is that is that a bloody hill there? Yeah, I guess. Now, Mr. Cavalry, you can join these guys over here. I have no idea what kind of freaking position this is, but it's awful. Regineers, um, you can just just run over there and just suicide, I guess. Oh, I thought, uh, I thought they, I thought they were way, uh, oh, I thought they were not that close. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. Also, I think I should probably limit myself of how I'm using the Grenadiers, cause let's be fair here, the Grenadiers are the most bullshit unit there is because of how overpowered they are. I mean, you can just throw grenades how many, how much you want. If there's one thing I wish that these Grenadiers had. And that it was either deplete the ammo that they have, or it was like a separate, ca like a separate uh, capacity. Like only uh, the grenade can bring like f either two or three sets of uh, grenades. So it's not like a unlimited amount that they can bring, because at the moment it's just unlimited how much they can carry, which is n not really that balanced. And it's really understandable why the guy that the Darth might just completely remove them. It's very understandable. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's the last of them. We just need to... Uh, we don't need to take care of these two guys and the battle is won. But we lost a lot of guys and I'm not gonna lie about that. This was a horrible plan. But hopefully, hopefully it will pay off. That you're running away? Good. Please tell me that was the last of them. Okay, good. I wanna know how many guys did we lose? Hopefully not too many. Let me see... 1833... Uh, I mean, if I would say, oh uh, yeah, I think we suffered almost an equal amount of, uh, of men there. That is, uh, that's not good. That is not good. The, oh, oh no, Sweden is moving on that Hanover. I really hope that Hanover can pull its weight here. But then again, with this mod right here, it does add in a few new units for minor factions. So I, I think Hanover can handle themselves. But then again, I really don't like to have a couple of meatballing sons of bitches on my back door. Thank you, Hanover. Thank you. Uh, cook last furnace. That's pretty nice. Uh, and another gentleman at Flanders, okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna just move you over here, see if we can Rebellion. steal something from France while they're still here. Rebellion, they're probably in Saxony, yeah, it is. Now let's see here, what can I do about you guys? You need some serious replenishing, not to mention we need uh, uh, one set of pikemen, but I think we can wait with that. Um, how about I do, uh, how about I did go ahead and do this, pikemen, you're not allowed to. But you guys can, yeah, you guys can get completely replenished. I'm gonna continue and besiege the, besieging these guys, or I could just do a complete Mad lad move and just besiege France all together. But if I do that with this weak of an army right here, that's probably gonna put me in, into a lot of trouble. But then again, it's just gonna be city defense units. I do not know what a good thing would be. You know what? Just because I'm that concerned, I'm just gonna save here. And uh, you know what? Fuck it! Yeah, that was really freaking stupid of me, but how about we go ahead and besiege these guys with these guys? That probably one of the stupidest thing that I can do, but I don't know what to do. Natural causes who die. Okay, that was a gentleman. I thought it was a general for a second. Let me see. Uh, how are you doing? Brave soldier to morale. All right. Don't have a general here, but it should be fine. Most of the guys are completely... They're just completely, utterly wounded, and I can't move my brake out of here. Ah, uh, 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 he'll be fine. See what's happening here? Prussia is moving in here. I think I can just swap this. Uh, I can just swap you. Yeah, I can swap you guys. 
I am not giving you. Uh, you're not getting your capital back, Prussia. You you lost your privileges for cap capitalism. That, no, that just sound. No, no, no. That that didn't make any sense. I'm I'm sorry. That ah oh, well, Johnny. See who's crawling back up. Oh, but wait. Your enemies with uh, with France now. So you wanna come to back to me now? Now that you're a fr now that you're an enemy of France, you're sending me mixed singles here, Johnny. But sure, why not? I'll you you'll come. Okay, fine, whatever. That's a twist. They didn't wanna they didn't wanna help me when I got attacked by France. But now that when they are at war with France, they was like, yeah, hey, um, I goofed up. We can be friends again, right? And yeah, fine. I, I guess why not, Johnny? I mean, Austria pulled that off on me, and they they accepted me back. So I guess I can't be a dick about it. Bloody rebels! That's right. Stay away. Now let's see. What can we do about France here? Now, oh really? You you pissy? Okay, you're not that pissy anymore. Right. Let's see here. What can we do about France here? You just need to wait one more turn, and that way, the infantry will get uh, replenished. I think it might just be a good idea to keep besieging them, just to be sure. Let's see, can I steal anything from you? And that's the only thing I can steal. Dividend on labor, that is good. How much money are we raining? Oh, that is good. Oh yeah, now we're back in the money, baby. We're back now. Let's see, uh, what else can we reach it? I don't think I need diamond formation, really. Uh, should I upgrade my military a bit more? No, I don't really think I need... I don't really think I need to. I think I can just try and maybe focus on my navy or artillery. If there's one thing I don't tend to do is to focus on my uh, navy or artillery. Because uh, using artillery is something that I'm really horrible at. Not to mention naval battles. That is not my strong suit. You can actually research that. I don't know about you. I need to upgrade your school for that. There's a better. It's better technology. So yeah, it is. Uh, yeah, I guess you guys can do that. Compare that. The next time you attack, uh, and I go completely dead. How are you guys doing? I don't like the looks of you. Just gonna go ahead and deal with that real quick. Uh, bing bada boom, you're ah. dead, son. The, oh, oh, I'm sorry. Is that supposed to be intimidating? Oh, I'm so. I should not have lost that many. Fuck's sake. I see, France didn't decide to protect me that turn either, which is good for me. I wonder though, I could auto-resolve auto this, but that means I'm gonna bring you guys in here. But then again, if I can take Paris, that's just gonna be a big plus for our economy. But what about this school right here? Two more turns. I mean, I, I could sit around and wait till that gets finished, so I don't need to waste money on that. And I think it's just best if we just keep France, uh, like, at this level here, so not so we can actually breed here. And actually, while we're here and we actually have more money to play with, I think we are gonna go out in the world and maybe colonize it a little bit. Let me see, I think that should do it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna bring that force and we're gonna go to India. And take this little island right here that used to be United Provinces, we com which we completely and utterly uh, knocked out. Let me see, Prussia, you are being a complete pain in my ass. Get the hell off my property! Why is there so much green around? No, no, no! Wait, what the hell is happening here? What the fuck? Great Britain, what are you doing over here? <laughs> okay, well, hold on a minute. What the fuck is happening here? Are you at war with New Spain? Yeah, you're at war with New Spain. Holy shit. No, I oh, hello there. I don't recognize you. Damn, you're old. 
Okay, but that's something. And so um, if you're if you're sitting at, and wondering like, wait, why is Louisiana, New Spain, and Thirteen Colonies still here? Well, here's the thing. Because I've been modding the game a little bit much, I did it so that the Protectorate becomes playable. Uh, in that case, um, they don't get hand over to the respective parent uh, Protectorate. So that is the reason why they're still here. But then again, I really, I didn't think Britain would just go over to Spain, New Spain and just fuck them over like that. So that explains why they don't uh, go for another naval evasion yet, I haven't seen that yet. So that explains why they've been so busy. Bloody rioters, can you please be calm? Sure, I can understand that when somebody comes in and you says that, Hey, this is mine now, I guess I can understand that you're pissed. And France didn't decide to attack me again. You know what, I'm sick and tired of waiting, give me this. And boom! We have taken control of Paris. I could have waited another turn so I can have that school upgraded, but I am impatient as heck. Uh, I guess you can work on that. Now, let's see here. Uh, you're gonna get very pissy here. I don't know what I'm gonna do about you. You guys can keep besieging that. Oh, can you? I mean, I could auto resolve it. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. I don't want. I don't want any baguettes here anymore. Get out of here. There we go. So that take care of that. You can go back to Flanders and defend that. Now, uh, now that we have taken Paris, hopefully that will take toll on the French economy. But then again, I'm pretty sure they're gonna retaliate and try to take their capital back. But we'll have to wait and see about that. Uh, let me see. You know what? You can go ahead and join with this army right here. I'm just gonna check how old are you? You are pretty old, so you're probably probably gonna die soon. Let's see, one more turn, you guys are gonna go off to India. I hope that we have a big enough of a force to actually take that island. I, I think so, at least. The, oh boy, they're coming at our capital once again. Um, I I mean, I wish I would be scared, but this is... You brought way too many cavalries, Franz. You brought way too many cavalries. Hey, cavalry, come here. Look at this juicy, juicy pike, man. You want this now, don't you? You want this? I know you do. Yeah, look at that. Good boys. Yeah, come here. Come here and feed. There's enough of everybody. Come here. Come here. I know you want some. Then you keep swarming and like bees. I mean, you would think that the AI would know a little bit better than just charging right touch pikemen in a square formation. But apparently not, and that just makes me a little bit sad. You're just standing there. Can I... Can I poke you a little bit? You don't mind if I poke you a little bit, eh? You don't... You wouldn't mind if I did, right? No, of course you wouldn't. You would... You like this, don't you? You like when big pointy men comes at your horse like that. And never you just... Okay, fine, you're just running away, alright. The end, you're coming around to round two, I see. It's a good one that these pikemen are doing some work here. At least they take care of most of the cavalry that they sent. Like, front, I thought you were gonna be a bit more organized when you go uh, going up against Germans here. Or, oh no, wait, I'm sorry, I'm not supposed to say that. That's way too early to say. Uh, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Eh? Eh? Okay, that's a very, that was a very tasteless joke right there. And that ended the way like you thought it would. Shame, France. Shame. Uh, oh, trading me with the Mod of Confederacy. You you want fire by rank? You can't use fire by rank. Would you give a naval show facility? Um, I mean, I guess. I mean, sh uh, you know what? Sure, why not? I mean, they can't use fire rank, which is a shame, I must say. But then again, technology for technology? I see that's a fair deal. 
nice that's done that's done and let's see about you guys are you guys ready you should be ready there we go i don't think i need that big of a fleet down there because i'm not hostile with the marathon confederacy and i hope it stays that way when we get over there you go over there oh that's not that's not fun uh india like that uh, yeah, I think uh, I think that'll be fine. I am not gonna end this episode until we actually colonize India a little bit. Replenish you guys. Uh, I maybe should probably try and reinforce Flanders and Rhineland so I can take this region from France here. Let me see. Are you bankrupt? No, you're not bankrupt yet. But I'm pretty sure they can't support that big of an army forever. Prussia. Prussia, no hard feeling. I can understand that this was your territory once but if you if you lose your privilege of having a capital you just lose it just take a hint that this is this is my space now and uh, you're giving up a very bad vibe here so can you please very kindly get the fuck out of here thank you prasha i knew that you and i would come to an understanding That, oh, oh no, oh no, 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 don't touch that. No, no, France. I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna tumble shame you if you don't get the heck away from me. Yeah, right to France. Because you got attacked. Even though that works in my favor. Go to India. Probably gonna take two or four. Three turns until you actually reach the, the continent itself. You guys, I, I don't like you. Get out of here. God damn Frenchies just going on onto, onto your land like that. Don't you just hate it when a bunch of French comes onto your land and like, Oh yeah, what's up? Uh, you're just gonna go ahead and just raid the place? Eh? I hope you don't mind. I very much mind that, sir. Right, that's nice. Uh, another gentleman in Bredenburg. Let's see here. I guess you can go over here. Aha, and I've been an thinking, now that we have a little bit of a better economy, maybe we can go ahead and mess with Sweden a little bit. I don't know what a good target would be, but maybe taking Copenhagen would be a good idea. That way we have access to another school. and may Or maybe Norway, because they have a royal palace right there. Good tax income from that, but I have to think about it a bit more. But if that were to happen, I guess it wouldn't hurt if I just start up an army right here. New line infantry, maybe. Yeah, two artillery should be fine, and. Uh, yeah, I think that will do for now. The one thing I have all. The one thing I want is to. Get to India and get a bloody colony there. Let me see, what are we going up against here? Uh, mostly line infantry, alright. No biggie. Told you it was no biggie. Yeah, that's nice, the fleet arrives, yes. Now the first thing I'm gonna do is to actually drop off the rake right here. I don't have any plans put for India itself, but I think maybe in the future, once we actually become strong enough, we're gonna declare war on the Marathi Confederacy, but that is probably gonna be the worst thing we can possibly do, but... Hashtag YOLO! So, a new time emerges in Saxony. I think I can go ahead and build one of these guys. Like, here's the thing. In this mod, it changes how you can uh, recruit rakes. You know, you need to build a coaching in in order to actually recruit rakes, right? Here's the thing. You can probably see that we don't have the option to build that. In order to do that, we need to build this. And once that has been constructed, we'll be able to choose from four different building options. Which, one of them is a coaching in, but I want to show up the three other ones. We'll have to take a look at that at the end of this turn. I mean, by next turn. Bloody hell, I can't talk today. Oh, oh no, oh god, oh! I was eating a munching on a bloody cookie! 
N oh, no, wait. Okay, I thought it was gonna be way more threatening than that is. Uh, Franz, I thought... I thought that you learned from bringing way too many cavalry last time. But now you brought more cavalry, not to mention four pikemen, and only... Like an infantry, three infantry and a quarter. Come on, Franz. You're busting my balls here. That, oh, oh no. Oh god, the models are broken again. The models are broken again. Nobody panic. Nobody panic. I I'll fix this. Don't worry about it. Franz! You bread forgetting bastard. You broke the models. The, oh, oh no. Oh god. No, Hanover. No, you can't die on me like this. Sure, you've been a bitch to me for leaving me behind like that. But you can't just leave. You can just. You can't die on me like that. And over. Do I need to protect my. Do I need to protect myself from Sweden right now? Because they. Yeah, they're gonna. T they are gonna take their capital right now. I mean, you can't bloody well see the building right there because the models are completely utterly broken. Okay, good thing we actually started building up an army right there. But before my computer bloody well explode on me, let's go ahead and take this island right here. Let's see, I think I should have enough move points to put them on the island. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this first, so I'm sure. Give me that, thank you very much. And just like that, we now have a colony in... Uh, India, yeah, I was just about to see Africa for some reason. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. So, if you like what you see and you want to see more videos like this, free feel a little like. And you, you can subscribe also, but then again, you don't really have to. But then again, do you really have a choice here? Anyways, I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye!